with uh, Shoreshade University. Another video. Today's topic is going to be on uh, when you're trying to reset your fully retracted position. Uh, occasionally, you'll run into a situation where your mid tube will not retract far enough back to set your one inch measurement. We run into this from time to time. Uh, it could be a memory problem, it could be an issue where uh, uh, loss of power to the system, um, any number of different things. So what we're going to do is right now what we've got is we've got two and a quarter inches on our measurement here and we need of course one inch. So and as you can see when we try and run the shade in, it won't come out in any further. It'll go out and it'll keep coming back to the same position. It won't come back any further. Whether you're using dip switch five and six individually, I'll, I'll demonstrate that. So right now we're going to have five on and it'll just control the port actuator. So it's only going out and back to that two inch measurement. We can't get it to go back any further. What we're going to do is, we're going to turn five back off. Right now the system is under the impression that this is the fully retracted position. So what we need to do is we need to tell the controller it's not fully retracted, it's extended so to come back in. So what we're going to do is we're going to use dip switch number eight. We're going to turn eight on, we're going to hit the reset button, and we're going to turn eight back off. Now we've stated this before in other videos and I want to take the, the moment to do it again. You have to understand there are no limit switches on the system. So if you go to retract this, have two people, have someone here on the actuator end up in the hard top wherever you are. Most of the time you guys can't operate the rocker switch and take the measurement. Have two people. Please don't ever use the remote control that some of the newer boxes come with to do these kind of procedures. There is a delay in the remote control when you hit the button. It's at least a second and a half to two second delay between when you let go and when the shade stops. So please don't use a remote control. You stand a chance of over retracting the shade and damaging the actuator. That being said, right now we turned on eight, did a reset, turned eight off. Right now, if everything's correct, which it should be, we ought to be able to bring these into our one inch measurement. So right now we're going to do no switches on. We're going to control both of them because if I'm not mistaken, we have the same measurement on both. We're roughly two and an eighth there, and we're two and an eighth here. So we can bring them both back in together, or you can do it separately. We're going to just do them together. So right now we're going to go in. Okay, there's one and an eighth. And see, this one retracted a little bit further than one and an eighth. So right now our port one, okay, there's our inch, and we're further than an inch here. As you can see, the two different measurements here, and that's usually due to that magnet that's on the flywheel of the motor. <clears throat> there's only one of them, so every 360 degrees of rotation it counts. So that's okay. What we're going to do is we're going to turn our starboard actuator on by itself, number six, and we're going to extend this back out. And this is the reason why. You have to have two people to do this if you can't see what you're doing. Okay, one inch, one inch, okay. Now we're going to turn off number six. Now we need to tell the system, the control box, we're fully retracted. And we do that by turning on number seven, hit the reset button, and turn seven back off. And right now, <clears throat> this system's ready to be deployed. It's full limits. It'll go all the way out, stop, and then you can come all the way back in. And as you can see, it'll stop, and we still have our one inch measurements on both tubes. Again, there is no reason or need to run the system all the way out and then do a reset on eight. It's not necessary. As long as we have our reset performed on number seven and tell the system this is fully retracted, our one-inch measurement, that's all you need to do. Okay? Thank you, guys. Again, if you have any questions, go on shoreshade.com. 
Uh, we've got videos, PDFs, uh, a lot of resources there to, to get your questions answered. If you don't find it there, feel free to give us a call and we'll help you any way we can. Thank you and have a good day.